Topology is related to the. It's, it's, it relates to things. On one hand, what is the charge in real space doing? And on the other hand, what is the wave function of the electron in reciprocal space doing? So it happens is there is a direct correspondence on how the. Uh, well, this is technical, but what the wave function does in the Brillouin zone. Mm -hmm. So if the wave function somehow twists, like when it goes around the Brillouin zone, then your charge in real space is going to be localized in a weird way or exotic way. Mm -hmm. Okay, so because of this twist and within real is related to the dynamics of the electron, mm -hmm. uh, you can have a flow of charge that is, is unique. I mean, it's mm -hmm. quantized, it has very low dissipation, uh, it flows with the same resistance, um, it's very robust and it's very difficult to kill because mm. uh, it has this topological order protecting it. So we have topology because we have this geometrical phase mm -hmm. uh, that uh, is added to the electron dynamics and it was neglected for many years. Now we know it's very important because it's very present. So we, I think, I mean, some of us think that we need to reformulate mm -hmm. uh, solid states physics, mm -hmm. adding this particular phase mm -hmm. to understand better the physics that lie behind and to discover new physics. Mm -hmm. So the fact that instead of being a rarity, it's something quite common, mm -hmm. force us to actually rethink uh, the fundamentals of solid states physics. Mm -hmm. Like a twist in the perspective of... Yeah, yeah, and it should be taught in every physics textbook mm -hmm. and physics degrees. And I mean, it's, it's, it's an important concept and a fundamental quantity that it's attached to the electron.